news coming in. In a major crackdown by income tax uh, sleuths over the last couple of days, few financiers have been raided. They are believed to have been involved in funding political party candidates. About 15 crore worth cash and 5 crore worth jewellery has been recovered. The investigation on to find out who they are as per aiding. The raids were undertaken over the last two days in multiple locations in Bengaluru. Income tax crackdown continues in Bengaluru. My colleague Deepak is joining us live on the broadcast. Deepak, just before the elections, uh, this is a major crackdown by the income tax sleuths over the last couple of days that we have, of course, been reporting. Well, various recoveries have taken place. 15 crore worth cash, 5 crore worth jewellery have been recovered. Give us more details on the entire incident. Well, the income tax officials, of course, keep a very close watch, especially in uh, pole-bound states, because uh, there is, of course, chances that money could be used to lure voters. Now, as far as, uh, you know, this particular search is concerned, we've been told that uh, the income tax officials have been uh, working out a list of people who could be help, uh, who could be helping, uh, you know, candidates uh, get hold of money, lose money, in fact, to distribute uh, to uh, voters. Uh, these are financiers primarily who have been searched up their homes. Uh, bank lockers as well searched uh, nearly about 20 crores total worth of of items including cash in 15 crores and about jewelry worth about 5 crores is the information that we have. These are very preliminary details. We are expecting a detailed statement if it does come by from the income tax officials. Uh, we, could all, we are also learning here that uh, these people of course who have been searched uh, could be helping candidates uh, you know, move around money through Hawala transactions as well. So quite a big uh, you know, search operation and uh, now we will really have to see once the investigation of course continues into this particular case what sort of details emerge as to whether uh, there are any there are single political parties involved or are these financiers backing many political parties or are they independent candidates? These are details that will only emerge once the investigation, of course, is thoroughly concluded.